Hey guys, just me here, uh, here with Cody. He has been resting all day. Poor thing, yesterday I took him to the pet vet clinic and he got all his shots and he was so good. Um, I don't know, the vet, it took him forever. It was like 15, 20 minutes. She's like, oh, his veins are... I don't know what she said. They they just had this big issue and couldn't, I don't know. They're like, oh, his veins are really thick. And I was like, oh my gosh. But he did so good. I'm so proud of him. He's been resting a lot today. But, you know, I expect that after shots. I don't know if you can hear, but it is here and see it's raining out again. Lots of rain. <laughs> so, yeah, yesterday was a really busy day. I worked earlier so I could get off early and take Cody to the pet vet clinic. I take him to <laughs> I take him to Tractor Supply and it was just a really long day. And I ended up, I went in and usually, I mean, it's only 4 to 5.30. So I got there right at 4 and there, there was like seven people in front of me. I was like, what? Because it's usually not that busy. But anyway, we went there, waited, and it, it was just, I don't know. There was some big commotion with some dog ahead of us. He kept taking off. They couldn't get him. <laughs> but yeah, Cody, Cody was so good. They just, they always love him. So, and like I said, I, I know, I get it. I, I have eyes. I see Cody is big. Um, I do the best I can. <laughs> the vet never has said anything, you know, oh, he's a big boy and just what a good boy he is. And, but I do, you know, I'm aware he's a big boy. I do the best I can. You know, I, I never asked for Cody. I I knew when I got divorced that it was going to be hard and having a dog is expensive. It really is. That's why I only have one, but I love Cody dearly, but my ex brought him home without asking <laughs> and he ended up hating him and just, you know, he would have got rid of him. So of course I took him with me when I left and I love him more than anything, but it's hard. It's expensive. And I try, you know, I have health issues. I try to walk them when I can. I also have to work. I can't just walk them all day. So I am working on things. I'm working on things for me too, because heck, I'm not the way that I'm supposed to be either. <laughs> but, you know, we're going to get out more because the weather is finally getting nicer. Well, not with the rain the past two days. The creek down here where I live is like so close to flooding. But anyway, <laughs> Cody is doing good. He's my baby. He seems happy. So, yeah. I do the best I can with him. Even when my ribs were out of place and I was in pain, I still took him out and tried to walk him some. So it's just, I do what I can. We had three acres, almost three acres in Indiana. He was never on any leash or tie out until we moved down here. So, like I said, it's been a big adjustment for the both of us. And I do the best I can. Yeah, that's all I can do. Anyway, I've been doing laundry and I don't have my lights on because it's harder to see. I have stuff drying in there, but oh, let's see. I wanted to show you my gate here. I don't have it out yet because I can't get out of here right now. Um, it's been raining constantly, but I cannot wait to use this. This seems really nice. It's sturdy, and this is from Teresa, I believe. So that was so nice of you to send that. You know, I was on my YouTube, and I didn't even know. You know, I just looked on there, and somebody said, Oh, you're going to be getting a gate on Friday. So thank you so much. I was so so nice of you. I can't wait to use it, you know, once it's done raining every day. And Cody can, you know, actually like go outside here. 
But I also wanted to say thank you because I got happy mail from, you guessed it, Miss Sandy. And let me see here, hold on. So Miss Sandy, I had a nice surprise the other day and um, came with this really cute card. And you guess it, you're never gonna guess who I'm gonna spend Valentine's Day with. Can you guys guess? I'll tell you here in a second. She was so sweet. She sent me a Walmart gift card that I can totally use. And this, I love Paul Walker. Well, like loved him. <laughs> I can't wait to watch that. I got this with four films. And I started laughing. I was like, is this Billy Ray? <laughs> it is mullet days. Is it? It's a mullet. I've never seen it, so I'm looking forward to watching it. That'll be fun. And she also sent me a thing of Keurig, the cappuccino, cinnamon dulce, I think. So that was a really nice surprise. She also got Cody. He loves these little broths. They're pour overs, so they're more than like his, his broth over there that goes over his food. And even some of these. So again, thank you, Miss Sandy. That really made my day. It just lifted my spirit. So thank you so much. And I, um, I did get my Cricut figured out the other day. So I have internet again. I was without it for a week. So yeah, there's a big misunderstanding, not on my part, on Cricut in Newport. Um, the lady had it wrong so I did go to Morristown and he was so nice and I talked to the manager and yeah hopefully she'll you know be talked to because she that was her not me <laughs> but it's taken care of luckily thankfully I have my internet again so so anyway me and Cody are going to say goodnight, and again, thank you, Teresa, for that pet gate. I cannot wait to use that outside, and Cody can sit out there whenever we have a nice day, and it, if it ever stop, you know, stops raining here, <laughs> but yeah, me and Cody are chilling. I'm watching a DVD, and that's it. Just a quick little check-in, guys, and... I hope you all had a good weekend and I'll be back soon. Bye guys.